Well, we are back up here at Blood Mountain, but we ain't going for no ride today though, because we got some other things that needs to get done, some other things that need to be addressed first, and then we can go from there. Ooh, bug on the shoe. Bro, excuse me while I clean this. Now it's dirty. Better now? I hope so. But yeah, we out here. So we're gonna get done uh, and we're gonna get going here in a little bit, but just wanna see uh, what's up. It's been a minute, so uh, we'll get back to you. All right, welcome back. Oh my God, you guys have no idea how good it is to be back on the motorcycle. It's been such a long time, man. Uh, here's where I normally stop, but I won't. We're gonna keep rolling. But man, it's been such a long time since I've been on the motorcycle. Dude, I'm, you get, you, dude, you guys have no idea. You really, like, I don't know. You might, because you guys like riding motorcycles. For the most part, you guys like riding motorcycles. So you might know what I'm talking about. But man, oh man, I have been fiending, fiending, fiending to get back on this motorcycle. Weather has not been cooperative. Life has been not cooperative. And so today I got the chance. I wasn't going to ride it, but I was actually gonna take my mom's car up here. Cause I was like, man, I'm not gonna ride in that weather. I don't know, it's cold, right? <laughs> I'm like, man, I don't wanna put up with being cold right now. <laughs> but my mom, she didn't bring her car. Um, her boyfriend brought her to my house so I'm like well crap I, I don't have a car and so alright I'm like okay I'm just gonna bundle up and get on the bike and get going it's a good thing that today is right around like 50 as you can tell up here it's around like 50 uh, so it's not bad uh, I, I am bundled up so uh, I was like alright man screw it send it fam and so here I am up here I said I have to go through I have to get to Blairsville so GPS is taking me straight through Blood Mountain I'm like oh yeah it, it's taking me straight through Blood Mountain <laughs> yes <laughs> and so I'm like screw it jump on the bike let's go <laughs> so here I am uh, going through Blood Mountain uh, like I said it's cold uh, I don't know the tires are probably warmed up. I checked them at the gas station before I came up here But the tires should be pretty warmed up, but like I said, I'm not gonna rip it, but I am gonna rip it though <laughs> uh, I am gonna have fun with it though <laughs> Because you just can't help it you come up here on a motorcycle you have to come up here and do a little bit I mean, I ain't going hella fast <laughs> but enough to have fun because it has been too long it has been way too long since I finally got a chance to come up here so you know I got to get a little bit looks like some of this stuff is still a little bit damp up here but we're gonna be careful though because I don't know how much they've actually if they had to actually like pour crap on this road so still got to be careful I'm starting to see signs of some material on the ground so I have to be careful still but I'm sure with the recent below freezing weather that we've had up here in GA that the um, roads up here is probably frozen over a little bit was a little bit frozen over so as you can probably tell in the center lane here they've got a bunch of probably salt and stuff like that so but yeah here we are we're slow traffic so it is what it is and I'm okay with that normally I might be a little bit like dang 
<laughs> but I'm okay with it. But yeah, I don't mind the slow traffic. Um, it keeps me in check because I like it is. It is. Uh, it's got some debris and stuff up here too. So still got to be very careful. Definitely want to make it to the destination. But I mean, I could stand to go a little bit faster than this. <laughs> The thing is, I am out here on the bike. That is the most important thing to me as a casual rider who just loves riding his motorcycle. That's what I want. I just want to get out and ride. And like I said, um, I always feel blessed to be able to just get out and have time to ride. Um, and so, man, I take every single second of that and I totally enjoy it and I love it. And I hope that you guys can understand how much I enjoy just riding this bike and just being out on two wheels. Um, again, people who know, you know, right? I mean, there's that sense of freedom, the, the enjoyment that you get out of it. And um, also the danger aspect of it, right? I mean, you're, you've got a, <laughs> got a tank full of gas on your booty. <laughs> it is strapped to something that ignites. <laughs> <laughs> yep, got to be careful up here. <laughs> got to chill for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah there's there's definitely salt on this road so it's not a whole ton but man I just come to realize it don't take much <laughs> I do not want to come up here and dump this bike up here so uh as I get further up the mountain, it does get seem to be a little bit heavier. So I gotta in some areas. Uh, so I gotta kind of be really chilled with it. But like I said, man, I, I dude, I I just can't. Ooh, ooh, I don't like that. Ooh, I just can't express how much I love riding the motorcycle. I really can't. Like, there's no words to ex describe how much there's not a phrase there's not a word there's not something I can tell you and say to let you know how much I love riding the motorcycle man it's like just love it I just love it so much and so like I said man I'm definitely glad that I got the opportunity to come up here even though I'm going for a different reason other than to just ride the bike I'm coming through a place that I always ride right you guys know me uh, you guys watch my videos I always ride up here and so to be able to come up through here and ride at a place that I love riding um, even though I have to go somewhere even though my destination is just not to ride um, I get the opportunity to kind of blast through some of the roads that I love going through so good times I love it I can't I'm not going to complain can't complain love this stuff but I'm glad that you guys have stuck around I know that I haven't put stuff out for a minute just because like I told you before just having uh, the weather being silly and um, the weather being silly Jesus Christ pick a spot pick a spot bro uh, just having the weather being crap um, and then just like I said just stuff going on in my life too uh, but I'm not complaining it's not something I can't get over it's not something that I'm not uh, working through or working out and so I'm not worried about it uh, <laughs> y'all have no idea how close that truck is <laughs> I feel like that truck was right on top of me I ain't gonna lie <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay.
No, oh, we're not doing that? Okay. <laughs> Holy crap, yep. That was almost there. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I gotta be careful, bro. That was almost there. I felt the tire slip a little bit. Oh my. Oh my. That was a little bit too aggressive in that one. Yeah, I felt the tire slip just a touch on that last one. So yeah, that was uh, definitely a pucker moment yeah yeah so if you guys ride motorcycles and you plan on coming up here to blood mountain don't <laughs> don't come up here uh give it a few days until maybe some of this stuff clears out uh because yeah oh jesus christ yeah this stuff is like everywhere okay Sheesh! Yeah, it's everywhere up here. So, yeah, don't come up here. <laughs> Woohoo! Because I'm totally only up here because I have to come through here, okay? I'm just telling you, I have to come through here, and that's the only reason why I'm up here. I knew that I kind of had a feeling that the roads might be like this. And so, yeah. But, again, don't hear me complain. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, be safe. Don't come up here. <laughs> because it's not great the roads are not great uh because they got salt on there and they got all sorts of stuff so just it, i mean i can't stop you right <laughs> because i'm having so much fun i'm just telling you i'm having so much fun i can't stop you i'm like hey it's fun up here but just be careful <laughs> you're gonna come up here You have to really mind these shades though, man. The shaded areas, I have to really kind of watch the shaded areas. Yeah, this big <laughs> turn up. I'm, oops. <laughs> this, this big turn right here. Okay, yeah, I totally got a, uh, be careful here because I have no idea what this is <laughs> Woo! so much fun but I hope that you guys had a great Christmas with your family and friends um i know that i did always do always enjoy watching yeah the crap this is ice right here bro i always enjoy um my time with the family during the christmas season uh obviously as you guys know i have a ton of kids <laughs> so uh, i always uh, i'm always broke during this time of year even more broke than uh even more broke than normal <laughs> uh during this time of year but I do enjoy I love it that I get to see the smiles on my kids faces and I'm sure you guys are the same way to see the smile on your kids faces if you have kids um, or grandkids you know, depending you know you could have a grandchild uh, depending on the range of audience <laughs> but yeah definitely uh, enjoy that time with the kids and definitely enjoy watching them smile uh, watching them enjoy um, all the gifts that they get even though they're I mean dude you know how kids are man they're like they open it and they're like woohoo this is awesome and then like they're on to the next gift and they completely forgot that they just opened a brand new gift that's still in the box that they technically hasn't haven't even played with and so you know kids are like that and that's fine uh, it is what it is but yeah man I, I hope you guys had a great Christmas um, if I don't make another video before the new year, I hope that you guys have a good new year. I hope that you guys um, get all the things that you you work towards so that you wish that you dream about. Um, and it's I can't I don't know what to tell you. Like if you dream it, I just say go and execute. 
I mean, if you want something and you're like, man, this is what I really, really want and this is a part of my dream, a dream for, my, for me, then I would say execute, man. Like, put a plan together, execute. And for the most part, maybe the plan doesn't work out, right? And maybe the plan is not executed perfectly, but if you stick with it, I think that, uh, I think that you will have success. I don't know how much success, but I think that you could, I think that at the end of the day, you would totally be uh, satisfied with yourself in regards to the hard work that you put in and, and the stuff that maybe came through. So man, yeah, man, put in that work, dude. Um, everybody puts in the work, everybody puts in the grind and let's just do it man like i plan to keep doing stuff uh, i plan to keep doing what i'm doing here moto vlogging and just riding the bike in general right i plan to keep doing that i'm not gonna stop uh just because uh i told you before you guys heard me before i love this stuff man i love coming out here and just riding even though it's sort of dangerous because like you know it's stuff like this it's slick still you don't know i don't know if that's black ice <laughs> i mean it's above freezing but still <laughs> it's in the mountains whatever but yeah so like i said man i'm up here i'm still riding around having fun and uh hopefully in 2023 if your luck wasn't as great in 2022 hopefully that changes in 23 and if you had good fortune in 22 uh, i hope and pray that 23 will bring you even more or continue success and fortune in your life and your family's life and all, all that nature so yeah man i again i i I can't express how much I appreciate you guys uh, kind of just hanging out with me as I just ramble on about stuff and basically just ride the bike around. <laughs> That's it. So I appreciate you guys, man. Well, here I am in the North Georgia mountains. Great scenery. This is where I'm supposed to be at. What is this place? Right there, the Georgia Heart Institute, Sweet B. Yeah, so what the hell are you doing at the uh, Heart Institute? Well, I got heart issues, man. No, I ain't got no heart issues. Um, they just want to scan me. Um, health check, fam. Health check. So keep yourself up to date on your health checks, family, because you never know, man. Uh, you just never know what's going to sneak up on you. So keep yourself healthy in 2023. That's what I'm trying to do. Keep myself healthy in 2023. Yeah. <coughs> so we all, we, we got to do that, fam. We got to do that. We got to keep ourselves healthy for our families. Um, and we got to keep ourselves healthy so we can ride longer. Yes, sir. All right. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright, we are all done with the Heart Institute up here in Blairsville, Georgia. But dang, boom, next time, oh, they find me a, cl a place that's a little closer, even though I love coming up here in through the mountains and stuff. You know what I mean? It's a little far. <laughs> just, for, just for a little bit of an appointment. It's a little far, but uh, it is what it is. We got it. Uh, we got it looked at. Got the old ticker looked at. Um, and hopefully everything's fine. She ain't say nothing was trippy. So I am going to pretend like everything is all good. And uh, we're going to go at it. And we're going to take life as it as it gives it to us, one day at a time. We're going to take that. We're going to love on that. And we're going to have some fun. But. I said we all done back on the bike I know my way home from here so we don't need no GPS but man hold up hold up hold up we got to get some music rolling though got to get some music rolling because I'm gonna be jamming all the way home fam all the way <laughs> <laughs> all right kick stand up let's go
all right i'm gonna go ahead and end that video here before my battery actually runs out because <laughs> i don't know where my battery is at but again i always appreciate you guys coming along uh and just enjoying my ride with me and i appreciate it if you guys go ahead and hit the sub button go ahead and hit the like and share this content and once before like i said i hope that you guys have a great and blessed 2023 if i don't see you before then until then though we'll see you guys on the next one peace